I'm Hung Yi Lee and welcome to iloveinteraciallove.com. Today we're going to talk about how to bring home the white boy. Okay, here's the scenario. He's white, you're not, or maybe he's black and you're not. But the most important thing is that no matter what your mix is, everything is going great between the two of you and you have really found happiness which is what makes your relationship so special. And everything is going fine until it is time to bring home the white boy to meet your mom and dad. This is the moment in an interracial relationship that causes the most fear, frustration, and emotional pain in couples. If my family rejects him, will he feel insulted and hurt? Will we have to sneak around? Will that drive us apart? If this is something that you are worried about, then you really need to watch this video. How do you bring home the white boy? This is a huge, huge question. How do you prepare for the meeting where you are bringing home the one you love to your loved ones? You really want your family to accept, embrace him, and love him in the way that you do so that he becomes closer and more a part of your life. Okay, listen, sometimes when we want something really, really bad, something that we think is going to change our life forever and we will just die if it doesn't happen, we can work ourselves into an emotional frenzy. Fortunately, there are some simple things that you can do to rock this meeting. Here are seven strategies for the both of you once you calm down. So calm down. Okay, before the meeting, number one, talk to your family. Find out as much as you can from your family, your family members, ask questions of your friends. See if you can really understand what is behind the fear so that you can overcome them. Number two, suggest a restaurant. This is key. Have your first meeting in a really nice restaurant. Bringing home someone for the very first time can feel like walking into a lion's den. Number three, create a picture of happiness. Your family wants you to be happy. The most impressive and meaningful thing he can do is to show them how blissfully happy he makes you, which is what they really truly want for you. When they see this, they will immediately realize the value that he brings to your life and to your relationship. Number four, respect the moment, be present, look into their eyes and listen. I mean really listen. This one is harder than it sounds, but it's the most important thing that you can do. To listen deeply and fully, focus on the person, what's being said, their facial expressions, and their body language. Once the social network circuits in your brain are fired up, all of the stress hormones decrease, and oxytocin, which is a hormone that enhances sympathy, fires right up. Remember, everybody wants to be appreciated, heard, and acknowledged for what they believe in and who they are. And even if you don't agree with what's being said, you will be perceived of in a personally positive light. Number five, take care of the bill. This is a home run waiting to be hit. Sometime before the end of the meal, have your guy get up, excuse himself, and take care of the bill. This is a classy, memorable way for him to leave a terrific impression on your folks. Number six, send a thank you. Very important. That's right, thank your parents. Thank them for giving you the opportunity to bring him home to meet the family. Number seven, hug each other. This is great. You did it! And if you have given of yourself truly in this spirit of sharing and wanting to get to know your family, you will have hit a home run. You give of yourself, give the love to your parents that they truly want for you, give them the confidence to cast out their fears. 
When you do this, you will attract the gift of acceptance that the universe really and truly wants to give you. So, good luck with your meeting. Let me know how it goes in the comments. And take the guesswork. Take all of that out of your guess who's coming to dinner scenario in your interracial relationship. You like all this I love? If you do, share it. Like it and join the mix. Pop your name and email into the box below and sign up and get all this great cool stuff that I have for you at iloveinteraciallove.com. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the mix.